Hey everyone, welcome back to Joanne Tech Lover. I'm Joanne and Intel sent me this really cool box. I have no idea what's inside and I'm super excited. So let's take a look. So shall I open it? Let's see how this works. It's heavy. Okay. Oh my God. Oh my Lord. Okay, it feels like there's sand in here. I should be careful. Need more leverage. Okay, I got it. There's bits coming. Oh my gosh. Okay, it looks organic. Or crap. Okay. Okay, this, you know, seems to host some sort of life. <gasps> okay. There we go. Okay, I was totally, totally not expecting this. And what does it say? It says, hey Joanne, do you know where the materials used to make your devices come from? I actually don't know. Um, but I'm gonna open this. There's another message. There are minerals in almost every piece of technology you own. That I do know. Now then, there's a lot of dirt in here, but I am uh, curious as to see what this stuff is. This card reads tin, and there's probably a piece of tin at the end of this. Oh, there's gold. Gold is cool, yeah. There's a big piece here. It says, how do you think these four minerals ended up in your device? Um, factory, manufacturing process, something like that. And obviously you have to dig for them in nature, right? Just like I'm digging in here. I am not afraid to get my hands dirty. Um, and this says tantalum, okay? And it's this rock right here. And let's see if there are any more. Aha! This one says tungsten, and here is this rock. Look, this looks like a silver ingot. I love it. <laughs> and there's just like all kinds of rocks in here, some like uh, roots and dirt. Oh my gosh, I think this is a gold nugget thingy. Can I keep it? So I am sure I will find something more exciting in here. Excuse me. Sorry if it's messy. Oh, here it is. What does that say? It says, some of the minerals came from mines in the Congo, where innocent people are being threatened by warlords. Okay, um, I was not expecting that, but I really do want to find out more about exactly what this is. So let's take a look inside this pouch. It looks like there is a laptop and it says you can help. So let's open this up and see exactly what's going on. We don't often think about how our devices are made. This is true. I don't really think about it a lot. I just think about how cool it is. And yay, it's a new product. I think that's actually really, really admirable. And I'm really glad that Intel is taking the initiative and spreading the word. I'm pretty sure that there's more to this than just a laptop. So I'm gonna keep digging because this box is pretty full of dirt. So let's keep looking. Ah, aha, there is something. Let's see what it is. Looks like another box. This one says, look for CF when you buy a device. And that stands for conflict free. Now then, what is inside? A message, it says, we're proud to say that Intel processors are now conflict free. And how appropriate to have a processor in here, right? Um, I'm going to actually remove it. And don't worry, this won't be going into a system. <laughs> So I can touch it. <laughs> anyway, so you get tin, gold, tantalum, and tungsten, all the minerals that I've dug out earlier, and they all go into a processor. The next time you purchase a processor, make sure it has the CF logo, which stands for conflict free. And what's cool is that all of Intel's CPUs are conflict free. <laughs>